Hey DP, I'm Macy. And I'm Dallas. It's hump day. It's time to dance our way through the rest of the week until prom. But before that, junior class office candidates, leadership info, and making your mark at graduation. DP News starts, starts now. now. It doesn't matter that your dream came true if you spent your whole life sleeping. So go out there and go for it, but don't be caught waiting. It's great to plan for your future. Just don't live there, because nothing ever really happens in the future. Whatever happens, happens now. So live your life where the action is, now. That was a famous grad speech, and DP needs some too. So dream, inspire, and leave your mark by creating a great grad speech. See Ms. Rehage in the activities office immediately. Speeches are due on Tuesday. Toyota will be here on Friday to show us their Toyota Scion. They will bring one of their cars and park it in the open grass area behind the Greek and next to the cafeteria. Be sure to come out at lunch to check out these cool cars. Prom will be rolling out the red carpet on Saturday at the Bacara, so be sure to buy your tickets now at lunch or online at the DPHS web store. After prom is full of gambling, food, and lots of prizes, so buy your tickets for that today too. Speaking of prizes, the following students won after prom prizes. Come to P2 at lunch to claim them. Uh, congrats to Mitzi Perez, Aiden Hovey, Joaquin Garcia, Yvette Perez, Lenny Nelson, Joel Murillo, David Dill, and Brandon Vargas. Come get your prizes in P2 at lunch or after fifth period. All leadership applications can be turned in today through Wednesday the 14th at 4 p.m. to Miss Rehage. Class officer elections are this Friday during your third period. Here are the sophomores running for your next year's junior class officers. Hey DP, my name is Ashley Oaks and I'm running for your junior class historian. Hi, my name is Jade Sinskull and I'm running for your junior class historian. I'm Amy Dixon and I'm running for junior class historian. Hi, I'm Rebecca Barado and I'm running for your junior class historian. Hi DP, I'm Jenny Jang and I'm running for your junior class secretary. Do the right thing, vote for Jenny Jang. Hi, my name is Lindsay Wilson, and I'm running for junior class secretary. Uh, hi, my name is Zainab Norsher, and I'm running for your junior class secretary. Hi, my name is Ethan Lamb, and I'm running for junior class treasurer. My name is Sierra Wong, and I'm running for junior class treasurer. I'm Wayson Uddin, and I'm running for junior class treasurer. Hi, DP. I'm Kat Hogan, and I'm running for your junior class vice president. Hi, I'm Jack Burns, and I'm running for junior vice president. I've got your back, so vote Jack. Hi DP, my name is Callie Zhang and I'm running for your junior class vice president. So this Thursday you should mark a tally for Callie. Hey DP, I'm Franny Barthel and I'm running for your junior class president. So be the man and vote for Fran. Hi, I'm Nathan Alvarez. I'm running for junior class president. Vote Alvarez for Prez. Hi, my name is Pauline Mickelson and I'm running for your junior class president. Hey DP, I'm Sofia Martinez and I'm running for junior class president. Good luck to all 18 candidates this Friday during elections. Today is Bike to School Day. This morning, as students parked their bikes in the front bike rack, they were greeted by a raffle drawing, wheel questionnaire, free breakfast provided by the mobile cafe, and loads of fun. At lunch, the raffle will be drawn to see who will win the grand prize, a bike of their own to take home. Also at lunch will be more fun bike-related games and activities, so be sure to come by the Greek at lunch. Here's Addie and Senid with more info about the Chalk Festival. Hey, Senin. Hey, Eddie. Will you go to prom with me? <laughs> no, I will not. But I'd like to talk about the Chalk Art Festival, if you'll let me. So the Chalk Art Festival is an opportunity for all you students to draw your favorite chalk art there at the flagpole. Um, and there's going to be boxes sold. And you want to tell me which those boxes are? Yeah, boxes are $5. And about $5. Um, chalk is also $5. Yeah. But can I BYOC? Yeah, bring, oh, bring your own chalk. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Good. Yeah, OK. Yeah. Um, so and you want to talk about the winner? Yeah, so the winner of our Chalk Art Festival gets a free square at the Iman Inari. The Mission. Yes, the Mission. And how much is one of those regularly? They're about $220, actually. Wow, so if you spend $5 here. $5 here. And win. And win. You get a free $220 square. Free $220. That's free $220 square at the and Mission. And sign-ups are in front of the flagpole today 
Thursday and Friday. And Friday. So sign up now. Sign up today. Club's meeting today are Breaking for a Cause Club, Local Colors, Spanish Club, Paintball Club, Catholic Club, Soin, Debate Club, DECA Club, Students Aiding and Volunteering for Earth, Ceramics Club, Te Aroma Club, Sailing Club, Theater Company, Environmental Club, Virtual Enterprise, Friday Night Live, Young Life, Good Food Club, Interact, Humanitarian Club, Junior Classical League Latin Club, and Indian Culture Club. That's it for our news. Have a splendid Wednesday. Happy birthday to Heather Cano. I love you. And happy birthday to Mackenzie Nadler. We all love you. Over to Nate and Peach with Yo Sports. Good morning. I'm Peach. And I'm Nathan, serving up your daily dose of news. Today, our boys swim and dive has prelims at San Marcos at 2 p.m. The team was joined by girls tennis last week and being recognized for having the highest GPA in all the southern section. Congratulations, guys. Our 16-3 and three tennis team starts their first round of Channel League doubles today at 2.30 here at DP. Yesterday, number two ranked Patrick Corpus dueled with the number three player from Santa Barbara and lost a tough match, ending his single season with a great record. Boys Volleyball came up short against Simi Valley last Thursday night, losing in the fifth set, 15-7. Curtis Redma had 13 kills, and Elliot Brainerd had nine with three blocks. Matt Sessler smashed 12 kills on the outside, and, and Jack Shervum added six kills. DP will take 14-11 record into the CIF playoffs. Senior Grant Emerson took the Channel League golf title yesterday with one over 73 and a two-day total of 146. Grant's win was one stroke better than SM's Niles Anderson, and now he and teammate Michael Nam advance to Monday's CIF Southern Section Northern Region Individual Tournament. Well, that's it for today, guys. I'm Peach. And I'm Nathan. Have a, Have good, a good one, one Chargers. Chargers.